Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. And today we're going to be talking about the biggest thing so far being talked at CES, which is the BMW iX Flow. Before we get started, please be sure to be subscribed to the channel, help out the channel a lot, and let's just jump straight into the topic. So starting off, this is probably one of the most talked vehicles or one of the most talked products from CES last week. So basically for most of you who don't know, I'm going to show the video right now, but basically this car is capable of changing its color from white to a dark gray and even the rims is able to change the, from white to dark gray and also has a bit of an animation to it. So basically this vehicle is probably getting a lot of attention obviously because of how cool it is and how futuristic it is because obviously sometime in the future we'll be able to have an option to change the car's color by just pushing a button on the phone or in the car. But Basically, this is insane for a lot of people. Now, this is all possible because of e-ink, which is not new at all. I mean, it was it is basically on your uh, Amazon Kindles, which is used a lot for people that love to read, for your e-readers. So it is still something that we all know of, but we didn't really know it was going to be used like this. So basically, the way it works, in simplistic way, to say it is basically that it uses basically electric current to change the color. So obviously with it, the iX being an electric car, it is suitable for this ink or e-ink of the paper. So obviously this did take them a bit of time to tailor, well, tailor it to the body of the iX because it is a certain type of paper that is made for this type of um, or oh, yeah, structure, <laughs> but basically it's very interesting for a lot of people. Now, a lot of people still say that this is very useful for cases of like climate or different climate zones. So if it's very hot, you can change the color to white so you can be nice and cool and the cabin's nice and chilled for you. And if it's a very hot or cold day, for example, you can change it to the dark gray, which also conducts more heat. So the cabin will be nice and toasty. Now, obviously, there are more possibilities that they will have more colors, but at the moment, this is what we have so far. But I mean, it's gonna be quite interesting to see a future where this is more standard on every single vehicle, especially if you can change it to like a blue, red, and even more colors, because then you can basically like say, one morning you want to go to the shops and you're just feeling to go into a blue car type of mood or go into a red car for racing or something like that. So this is very big for a lot of people and a lot of motor companies that are wanting to step up the game of the vehicles. But it's very interesting. It's very mesmerizing. I mean, I've probably seen so many footage or so much videos of this car that I'm just memorized about how it just smoothly transitions from white to dark gray and have the weird animation and the racing stripes. But it's a very interesting thing to see and I really hope they do make this into production vehicle sometime soon. But so far it is still in the works because obviously it's still new. But I'll try to keep my, well try to stick to this topic very soon. We'll try follow up for this topic because if this does go into production it's probably gonna be a big vehicle and I mean it's to the, uh, the iX I mean BMW's SUV EV which I like a lot and I mean it has about more than 400 kilometers of range but otherwise it's a very nice vehicle nice way for them to display this new technology for the cars and if it does become a reality and have more color options, then that's gonna be a big thing for BMW. And if they do a lot of other brands to use it, then it'll change things a lot. But otherwise, that's what I really say. My thoughts of this thing is it's amazing, groovy, and probably the biggest thing from CES this year. But otherwise, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Hope you guys enjoyed. And if you wanna see more videos kind of related to this type of topic or even more videos, and hit that subscribe button. Otherwise, see you guys in the next video. And yeah, hope you all have a great day and see you guys in the next one. Bye.